tormented main character and guiding him to freedom. Continue the story from where you left off. Ages a great time to be alive for beer lovers. And that was the beer trivia for the night. Empty? You still want a drink? No, I'm cool. video to anyone? I sent it out to my friends. Who knows? It might actually bring them happiness. Next time. Maybe I should stick around a little. Oh, going home? Did you end up sending that video to anyone? I sent it out to my friends. Who knows? It might actually bring them happiness. Okay, I get it. Look, I'm just worried, okay? Not just you. Everyone's been acting kind of weird lately. It's fine, Erica. We're not gonna fall apart at the first sign of trouble. I'll see you later. You know Catherine, right? Maybe it's some other Catherine you know. Honestly, man, I wouldn't be surprised. She's always meeting new people for work. this point on, your skills will be tested by various puzzles. Bomb blocks are lit when you walk over them and will damage nearby blocks. Where am I this time? There's still more?
best to try and undo it. Oh! <laughs> 
I made it because of you. Promise me that you'll make it to the next level, too. You're pretty popular now, huh? I'm finally able to play the way I want to play. I think it's because you accepted me for who I am, Vincent. Really? I'm glad I'm regaining my memories, but... I'm also scared. Scared of what? What if I get my memories back, and I discover something about myself I didn't know existed? Don't worry, Ren. You are you, no matter what, right? <laughs> Your words always give me courage, Vincent. I wonder... <laughs> that guy with the pompadour seems to be missing. He didn't fall yesterday because of that thing, did he? I don't know. I thought we could all make it out of here if we put our heads together. I guess it's not that easy. Hmm. I see you're safe. Let's talk about our techniques. We've all got to keep climbing. Yeah, let's work together and get out alive. This technique just hit me. Allow me to explain timber. If you want to drop an entire wall, leave a supporting block and push out all the rest. Then, push the supporting block, and the wall will all fall down in one piece. Don't you think it's useful? Oh, I just had an idea. What do you think of this? Allow me to explain controlled explosion. Bomb blocks are hazards that turn blocks around them into cracked blocks. Heavy blocks and immovable blocks can't be destroyed. So you can rely on them in areas that have fun. That's just inspired. What a great idea. Oh, man. I wish I'd thought of that. Not bad. man who bumbles his way through the real world. Come on, hurry up and ask your question. I want to get this over with tonight. This is the eighth question. Are white lies acceptable? <laughs> That's your answer. I see. Humans are quite fascinating. The deeper their bonds grow, the more suspicious they become of each other. Shut up, I have enough to worry about back home. No, you must continue to worry, both here and in the real world. What's true, what's false, and what path shall you take? <laughs> two types of bomb blocks with different blast radii. How brightly they glow will help you figure out which is which. I'm not gonna die. Commencing area two. Are you ready? All right, I got it. Yeah! 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 
to undo Edge. and try and do stuff.
Right, I got it. Your piano is reassuring as always, but is it just me or have you gotten a lot better? I think when I hugged you yesterday, my heart filled with warmth, and then you listened to what I had to say. It really made me happy. So I channeled that emotion into my music. And thanks to that, I'm getting closer to being able to play the way I always wanted to. This must be the power of love. <laughs> situation, but you can only fall to the level of your training. Like what? Try this one on for size. Allow me to explain bombs away. After activating a bomb block, quickly move it away from the area. If you push the bomb block off an edge before it explodes, the blocks around you will not be damaged. Well, did that seem useful to you? It should help. Have you seen this one? Allow me to explain Sproin. When you get on a spring block, you can jump upwards five blocks. You can move spring blocks, so use this knowledge to propel your skills to new heights. Nice! You're brilliant! All right, what's next? That sounds pretty useful. I expect nothing less of you. piano player. Sheep that would have died a long time ago are still alive. And what about those guys who attacked me? What's up with them? Ah, yes. There are many sheep like that now. They've lost their sanity. If you lose your mind, all you have left to lose is your life. They don't exist in the real world anymore. Are you serious? This is the ninth question. What would you do if you saw someone you know cheating on their partner? survive from here on out. The trials will only get longer, so there's no time to waste. Then hurry the hell up. I'll get out of here before the night is over. Very well. I'll take you to the next level. against time on this long staircase. 
Use the items to your advantage and reach the door before you lose your footing. Just let me climb this tower like normal, damn it! Commencing area three. Are you ready? All right, I got it. to undo and try a new strategy. Got it. Edge. Undo. Once again, you're quite tenacious.
<sighs> I don't cheat. I don't go out and party. And the woman I love is... And I get these nightmares too? This sucks. <laughs> that was amazing. I really admire your determination, Vincent. Ah, flattery will get you nowhere with a loser like me. You're not a loser, Vincent. You gave me a place to stay when I lost everything. You cheered me up whenever I was feeling down. You're kind, and you see people for who they are on the inside. You've given me so much in this short time, Vincent. Oh, Ren. So... <laughs> What's wrong? My head. Are you okay? Maybe this is what it's like to be sick. I did take a cold shower. So you need to take better care of yourself. Wait, there's more? I'm gonna throw my back out. I'm glad you made it up all right. It's like my hands are just moving on their own now. I don't know how I got so good at climbing this stuff. Hey. Hello. This guy's come up with several techniques. It proves what kind of man he is. They're not new, but they're all logical and useful. That's the mind of a leader. I guess my business experience is paying off. It really does feel good to help out others. Hey. said about the tide shifting and what the hell does that have to do with anything well it's almost time this is the 10th question for a new possibility what factors in the most when you make an important decision you choose, your life might change rather drastically. And at the core of it all is that pianist. Rin, what are you talking about? Your true value is about to be tested. Of course, your options will be limited. The choices you've made will determine what paths remain. I wonder what kind of trial they'll lead you to. <laughs> Scary, isn't it? Walking into an uncertain future like that, your next challenge is that fear itself. This is the final area for tonight. Observe the traps created by the enemy and stay calm. All right, let's just climb this thing and get it over with. What? There is no way! I'm not your dad. Definitely not your dad! Child with chainsaw has appeared. All right, I got it. Do not die. Oh, oh. 
Undo. Open this. A victory. Whoa! Oh shit. Sorry to say, tonight will be the last time I show you your memories. You've seen enough by now. To conclude, let's pick up where we left off on your budding romance. <laughs> Yikes. I drank way too much. I'm really sorry, you know, about last night. <laughs> We're both adults here. There's no need to apologize. What are you in the mood for today? I could make breakfast for us. Hey, Catherine. Hmm? Question. Do you want to be my girlfriend? How's that sound? Huh? <laughs> About time. Well, do you remember what you held so dear? To be honest, I planned to enjoy watching a pitiful lamb drown in his regrets. But this took a turn for the unexpected. You truly are interesting. What lies ahead is a direct result of the path you've taken thus far. Will you let this experience fade into the past? That's up to you. here anyway I, I mean they the, the ants what, what are they doing here stupid ants they're after this what is it cake well who did you get this from how did ants get here so damn quick that's the cake Catherine brought me a while ago oh I've got a, a real sweet tooth is all <laughs> uh, wait really so do I <laughs> So, uh, when did you get here? Oh, what, like you forgot? You said that you were feeling better, so I hurried right over. Huh? When did I tell you that? I guess my memory's a little fuzzy. Aw, you always say that. <laughs> Relax, you worry too much. Trust me, you are just fine, baby. <laughs> well, 
Gee, thanks. Uh, oh, yeah. I uh, don't have time today. No! Ah! Ah! What, what is it this time? It's, it's that horror movie I told you about. This is the last week they're going to be showing it in theaters, uh, remember? What? What movie? I don't know what I'm going to do if I miss it. Yeah, okay, okay. Can we wait till tomorrow? I've kind of got some stuff to take care of today. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> All right! <laughs> hey, this will be our first real date! It'll be so much fun, don't you think? <laughs> I am totally lost here. Ugh. Ugh. Yes! <laughs> Ugh. Look, I've got to ask you something. You know what I'm talking about, right? Huh? Don't you have anything to tell me? Vincent, what in the world are you talking about? All right, I'm just going to come out and say it. W wait, Listen what's to going me. on? I, uh, I heard something the other day. What did you hear? Something from an acquaintance of yours. What? Who? Uh, well, do you know a guy named Steve? Steve? Yeah. Hmm. I don't know anyone named Steve. Exact. Wait, what? Y you don't? No. No? Not even one? Like I said, I don't know any Steves. Well, how could you not? I mean, Steve's a pretty common name, right? Wait! I did meet a Steve yesterday. <laughs> yesterday? My friend's son was named Steve. I think. Son? How old is he? Um... Two months, maybe? She'd just come back from the hospital. No, no, not him. Don't you know any other Steves? Huh? Well, I'm sure I do if I check. You, you mean you have to check and see if you know anybody named Steve? I guess so. Look, what is this all about? <laughs> well... Speak up and tell me. Who's Steve? Some friend of yours? What are you getting at? Well, if you don't know, then let's just drop it. But you sure you don't know him, know Steve? Why do you keep asking me that? I told you, I don't know. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Never mind. Huh? Oh, uh... <laughs> What is going on? Did I get the wrong girl again? I, I can't think of anyone else. I'm glad to hear Catherine's not cheating, but this is not good. Maybe I should just tell her. No, then she'll think I'm taking some random guy's word over hers. Shit, what can I say to make her believe me? Uh, well, it, it, it's a good thing you don't know him. There's this asshole at my work who said he might know you so uh huh are you okay you've been acting weird lately you're pale you say things that don't make any sense yeah well you know what there's a lot of stuff that doesn't make sense lately like the future and everything i don't get it uh, what do you mean you don't get it uh, well... What part of our future don't you get? That's not what I meant. I, I mean, I'm, I'm worried about work. It's a new job and all, and... ...having problems with the clients, so I'm tired. <laughs> I've been... 
getting strange texts lately. Strange how? I don't know. They don't make sense. It's just creepy. <laughs> Wait, what do they say? What are the words? You know what? It's not important. Just forget it. Okay, but... Look, Vincent. You're not hiding anything from me. Are you? Huh? Shit, I'm making her worry. She says she's getting weird texts. I have to reassure her somehow. Come on, I'm not keeping anything from you. Well, you've got to go back to work, right? I do too. Um, I should go. Huh? Okay. I'll call you. Which girl? What are you talking about? Yeah, well, I asked around, and nobody knows who you are. You... you told her? <laughs> well, yeah, of course I did. I mean, that's the quickest way to split up, right? Y yeah. But, but what do you mean, nobody knows me? Well, that's exactly why I called. Look, wh why don't you just tell me something about the girl you called me about? Like, what does she look like? Sorry, but you got the wrong guy. What? I, I know a girl named Catherine, but it's somebody different. What? Don't you try to fool me. Look, the Catherine I know, she's white. Uh, it can't be. I, I mean, she told me about you herself. It's a different person. I don't blame you for all this, but please, just leave me alone. What's going on? I, but, but where's my Catherine? How should I know? divorcing my wife she came into my life suddenly and then i just uh i'm sorry to hear that I, i'm going crazy it's gonna come for me and i look i'm the one going crazy here <laughs> i won't call you again so leave me alone okay wait wait, wait no don't hang up i still have what the hell was his problem You in there? What happened? Hey there, Vincent. Good morning. R uh, Rin, are are you uh okay? I think I am. But, but you you uh are you a guy? Oh, yeah, that's right. Well, my shower wasn't working. Wait, 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 wait. So I I'd this can't be right. Is Ren, Ren, Ren seriously, seriously a guy? I, I mean, I, I had no I fucking clue, clue when I was falling. I mean, no, no, I wasn't falling in love or anything. I mean, what kind of a guy looks like that? What was I supposed to think? I mean... <gasps> and then my memories came back. Hey, Vincent, are you all right? Don't touch me! <laughs> I'm sorry. Ren, wait, please! Sitting here is not gonna fix anything. I gotta go apologize. Ah! Catherine! 
Vincent! What are you doing in there? Oh, there was just a... problem with the plumbing. What are you doing here? Oh, well, there's something I wanted to talk to you about. Do you have time? Well, uh, does it have to be right this second? Um, well, yeah. Huh? Are you serious? Are you gonna get it? Oh, no. If I waste any more time, I might not be able to find Rin. This thing with Catherine seems pretty important. Either way, it's sure as hell not a good time to pick this up. Sorry, Catherine. There's something I need to do. I'll hear you out later. I promise, all right? Oh, if it's that important, I, I understand. Sorry for bringing this up out of nowhere. Just don't worry about what I said. You should hurry. Yeah, thanks, Catherine. Maybe I should have been more honest with him. Is Ren here? Did something happen, Vincent? Well, I kinda saw Ren naked and... Wait, you guys saw the doctor? You... Have you known this whole time? Come on, this isn't some horrible... <gasps> Don't tell me you lashed out over this! Seriously? Call and apologize right now! Yeah, okay. Rin, listen, I'm sorry about earlier. I, I didn't mean it. I was just surprised. Vincent, um, I'm sorry too. I ran away so suddenly. No, no, don't apologize. This is all my fault. Where are you? Are you safe? Yes, I'm fine. It's getting late. Why don't you come back to the apartment? No, I can't go back. <sighs> what you want. I'm sorry. I just thought maybe you'd be okay with it. Oh. I knew you had a girlfriend, so I wasn't planning on telling you this. But when I saw how kind you were, how you didn't judge people by appearances, I started dreaming about the future. Rin. For someone for the first time, I felt my world growing bigger and brighter. It was only a few days, but I had so much fun being able to play the piano and help you are memories I'll treasure for the rest of my life. You'll, you'll make it through without me, Vincent. So please, promise me you'll find your own happiness. Girl's a guy, huh? You just can't judge a book by its cover these days. 
come on. You're acting like you've never seen anything like this before. No skin off my back. I only have eyes for Erica. So, what happened anyway? Well... Shit. After something like that, I'd run away too. Right? What an asshole. Excuse me, I had no fucking idea. falling apart, hearing a love confession is pretty damn powerful. Now, may I please have another drink? Jeez. Oh, Wait! Rin confessed? Hey, Toby. Come here a sec. Huh? Uh, okay. <sighs> Look, I get that it must have been a pretty big wake-up call. Just take that loss and move on. It's not a loss, all right? Are you saying you're interested? I don't know. Maybe. Whoa there, are you serious? Look, no matter how cute, the kid's packing heat, I know man. that. It's just... Rin accepted me the way I am, you know? Well, what exactly do you want here? Hey, are you paying attention? Hey, Vincent. Why do you care about Rin so much? You guys just met. How deep could your relationship be? It's hard to explain. It's like... Rin helps me see things in a way I never even thought about before. Like a whole new perspective, I guess. Not to mention... Rin saved our lives. Saved our lives? When? What are you talking about? We're the ones that did the save. Huh? Oh, yeah. Right. I get it. It's a change of pace for you. No one would fault you for that. But it's starting to sound like you're actually in love. Are you? In love with Ren? I mean, I can't deny that I feel something. But is it just as a friend? Or is it something more? I can't keep my thoughts straight. Who is Ren to me? I can't let someone like that get hurt. Ren needs me. But is Ren... The only one who needs me? Uh, yeah. I can't forget about Catherine. No. Uh, I mean, yeah, we're close. It's not like Ren's the one. That seat's taken. <sighs> Thank you. Sorry, dude, but you brought this on yourself. That's for sure. By the way, what happened with the whole Catherine cheating on you thing? <sighs> that turned out to be the wrong girl. The wrong girl? Yeah, the Catherine he was talking about was someone else entirely. Gee, 
Jeez. Seriously? Well, lucky for you, this was just some dumbass's mistake. The world's full of troublemakers. It, it can't be. I, I mean, she told me about you herself. No, I mean, there's no way. He has to be mistaken. Oh, you guys better be careful, too. Haven't you heard the rumor? Ah, that again? They say all the men who died were cheaters. So they were cursed. Ah, just get your ass back to work. Vincent isn't cheating anymore. So there's nothing to worry about. The curse, huh? Oh, well, that's great. I've got no choice but to accept it. Well, look, when you feel guilty, sometimes you want to be punished, you know what I mean? But this curse stuff is just crazy. It's not rational. Grow up, man. Besides, there are plenty of other ways to die in your sleep. Plus... Plus? Well, you know... I've sort of been having funny dreams, too. Dreams? Well, to be honest, I've been having odd dreams recently myself. And like you were saying, I don't remember exactly what they're about, but... Yeah, it's some hard shit. Well, hey, are you serious? <laughs> it's fine. Don't worry about it. It's all just dreams. Yeah, but are you sure it's fine? Of course it's fine. Wait a second. Come to think of it, he, he said something. Uh, it's gonna come for me, and I... What's going to come for him? Am I missing something important here? Anyway, this is about you, Vincent. What are you gonna do? Huh? Oh, my nightmares were all caused by this trouble. But they forced me to realize something. Which is? I took everything for granted, up until now. I feel like now, I remember what I've always held dearest to me. Sounds selfish to me. <laughs> really? I know, but I can't betray the person who's been with me all this time, despite who I am. I can't lose her now. Yeah, that's the spirit, Chief. Then maybe you shouldn't be here drinking right now. Well, yeah. Mm. I've got something left to do. I need to change my focus. I see. Hey, fear me. Sure, let me get that for you. Yeah, that's right. Let's get to drinking while we're thinking. Your treat. Yeah, right. Nothing's wrong with you? I don't have nightmares. I sleep like a baby every night. If you keep smiling like that, I'm gonna deck you. You can tell I'm happy. To be honest, me and Erica are... Uh, anyway, let's, let's have a drink. <laughs> uh. Look, Vincent. You're not hiding anything from me. Looks like I was the only one hiding something. 
Can you check the high scores for that game? Why are you boasting? Huh? What? I've got the high score right now. What, really? Oh, well, uh, <laughs> I'll beat you soon. You guys are really into that game, huh? Yeah. You got a mail. Nothing more to worry about. Yeah. You've still got a mess to deal with. What you gonna do about that girl you're cheating with? She's still in the dark, right? I'm a terrible person, aren't I? This is my fault. I'm not gonna run from it. You go, Vincent! I'm gonna break up with her tomorrow. Once I'm clear, I'm gonna... propose to... I'm sure it'll all work out. Yeah, thanks. some trivia for you, as you seem to have finished your glass. Various types of glasses are used for cocktails. Extra long glasses used for long drinks are sometimes called zombie glasses. The name derives from the cocktail the glass was originally created for, called the zombie. The drink was so named because it contained alcohol so strong that it revives the dead. Be careful not to drink too much and turn into a zombie. That was the cocktail trivia for tonight. Empty? Erica, I need a drink. Take your order. Sake. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. Sure thing. Just wait. Keep on drinking. Hey, about those nightmares. Is it true you're all? <sighs> Whoa, this is really spooky. What was that nightmare about? You got a mail. Give up and move on. Erica, she's an angel. More like a demon. 
let's hope she's that too. <laughs> This is sudden, but here is some trivia about sake for you, as you seem to have finished your cup. Kuchikami sake, or mouth-chewed sake, is considered to be the first artificially crafted sake. The chewed rice is placed in a container and left to ferment. The enzymes from the chewer's saliva break down the carbohydrates in the rice to produce the alcohol. You might think this would be something fun to do in your spare time. However, the mouth is full of germs. So it's probably best to simply leave it to your imagination. And that was the sake trivia for tonight. Empty? You still want a drink? No, I'm cool.